been going 30 years. Uh, it was originally an IBM in-house choir through their sports and social organization and some years ago it came out on its own. It was originally called the Master Singers and changed its name oh, five or ten years ago to Hogarth Singers which is a more appropriate to where we're based. Purely amateur, non-audition. Non they are excellent. I always enjoy their concerts, very much indeed. I mean, I particularly enjoy the sort of music that they choose to sing and I think there's always a good, friendly atmosphere. Um, I enjoy every aspect of it. I'm Helen Stevens, sing alto. I've been in the choir for about eight years, yes, yes. Uh, oh, it's just wonderful. I love this sort of music anyway, and it's wonderful to spend time with people who like the sort of music that I like. I'm Sue Hardwick. I'm presently the chairman of the Hogarth Singers. I'm a second soprano. Um, I've been in the choir six or seven years now. There are some people, quite a significant number in the choir, who do not read music, who work very hard at learning the music off by heart and are learning to read music because that's also one of the things that the music director does is give us the opportunity of, of, of improving our musicianship and to learn to read music and to practice that. So it's, it really is an amateur choir. It's a non-auditioned um, choir although we do ask any newcomer to sing a bit to the MD um, and he, you know, he then decides whether we're in, they're in the right part or not.